Hey what's going on guys, in this video we are going to see how to derive energy level equation for this infinite potential well, in other words particle in a box. When we derive the equation like uh, after we solve the Schrodinger equation we will get a solution like this for wave function we will get a solution like this psi of x is equal to a cos alpha x plus b sin alpha x. If you want to know how did we derive this one you can watch my previous video. I have taken the interval like x is going from negative a to positive a and uh, it's also similar to this one so we solved and derived this equation here you can see our potential well is going from negative a by 2 to positive a by 2 and also the potential energy function outside is infinity and we are going to find what's going to be the energy level now when we solve this one we have to apply the initial conditions initial conditions are x is equal to negative a by 2 and x is equal to a by 2 so we have to apply that one instead of x and when we plug that one what we are going to get is we are going to have a cos alpha a by 2 plus b sine alpha a by 2 is equal to 0 and the other one is going to be a cos so this is when we apply plus a by 2 when we apply minus a by 2 we are going to have alpha a by 2 this is remaining positive because cos of negative alpha a by 2 is same as cos of positive alpha a by 2 so we don't have to change anything but for sine it's different if you put negative alpha a by 2 that's equivalent to negative b sine alpha a by 2 so instead of putting the negative here i can move this negative right here and keep this one as positive so this is going to be b sine alpha a by 2 that's going to be equal to 0 so from this one after we solve this one like you can add these two together when you add this b sine b sine cancels and we you will get 2a and cos of this number like cos alpha a by 2 and also when you subtract uh, this cos will cancel and you will get this one and after that you can easily solve for alpha and when you solve for alpha you will get this one alpha is going to be n phi a n phi over a so from this one we can derive our energy level like energy level equation that is given by en that is equivalent to n square phi square h bar square over 2 ma square you may wonder how did we get all these terms this is the term we took for the constant like when we deal with uh, when you do surging surging equation when you solve from surging equation you will get a constant that is equal to alpha square so I'll, this is alpha and we equate that one with alpha square you can watch my video on x is going from negative a to positive a i have explained that one clearly so uh, that's how we derive the energy level equation for an infinite potential well i hope this helps thanks for watching